Hello, welcome back. Last time I found a surprisingly large number of exhibits. There were just like a whole bunch in the group of islands that I did. Got this real hard puzzle here. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. Maybe this? Well, that didn't work. Okay, let's try this. That worked. Okay, so, um, diagonal. So put that there, maybe. Other possibilities also exist. Is it not pretty trivial to just... Oh, no, it's not, because I can't stand there. All right, well, if I had... Hmm. Okay. So that's the complication. So it feels like I want a vertical bridge up here, made out of this small tree. Alternate answer, raft here. That looks pretty impossible. Hmm. Alright, so what does look possible? So I have an extra tree way over here, which I can't do a whole lot with beyond, like, that. Which really doesn't mean anything in my current setup. That's obviously not what I want. But I'm really not sure what is. So if I do that, I can change how far over you go. Sure. This lets me actually manipulate you a bit. Why though? Hi monster. Like, nothing's being helped by any of these moves. And, like, if I take this further, I can't. I, I can, maybe. No, not really. Not the way I'm thinking. Okay. Uh... What do I want? This can't ever go anywhere, no matter what. This goes in the water. Can't chop to the west, so it's just north. Pushing east is not useful. I can't push any other direction than west. Obviously, I need this to stop that from going in the water, but why? Okay, precondition for a vertical bridge here. I mean, that log would just have to be not horizontal in this spot. And I don't see how that's ever happening. Since I can't chop this thing horizontally and get it anywhere, it really doesn't feel like I'm ever building a raft there. Now, I do get the opportunity to mess... W uh, well, not really meaningfully. Yeah, I can do that. It doesn't do anything, though. Huh! Okay, so which of these are useful? This at least has some offset, so I can... I can go south with it. It feels like that's never going to be useful for anything. So maybe my goal is... Yeah, I think I see it. I think I see it. It's subtle. Uh, but I think I do see what to do here. So am I correct that if I... Okay, if I chop this here, that goes there and pushes you there. Now if you go here... Yeah, okay. So your purpose is to do this. Yep, that's the whole thing. Okay, that's not so bad. Neat. It was what I saw. Uh... 
So bridge over there with alarm clock, sure. Or what? No, bridge to the alarm clock. It's not used in the puzzle. I can push you back over, get you there if I want, which is not too useful. However, what if when I did that, I had this in the way? It would roll over, sure. Uh, does that help me? I doubt it. However, maybe it does? No. No, it does not. Huh. All right, so ways off of this island. Um, hey, wait a second. There's an unchopped tree there. Oh, right, in a spot I can't reach. Right, because I've I've been on half of that island, but there's a there's a rock barrier. Uh, okay, so alternate things I could do with this. Yeah, useful. That's no good for anybody. All right, so I guess I need to think about preconditions for horizontal bridge here or here. There is not going to be a way to put a three wide one here. Probably. It's hard to imagine that there would be. So getting, oh, I think I see something. Uh, I don't think I can do much about it though. Well now, hang on. Okay, so you can be pushed over here after that chop and nothing good happens. Uh, yeah, great. Oh no, it lets me make that move. <laughs> hmm. And similarly, this would let me get that there without going in the water and actually make a raft out of it. Uh-huh, okay, we're not in useful territory yet, but I've at least found things I can do. So once again, preconditions. Um, if I were making a raft, it doesn't matter if I try to make a raft because like this has to get over there and participate in the, the raft construction regardless. And there's no conve- oh, hang on. Okay, I'm seeing some things. Almost. No, not really. Wait, hang on. Uh, you feel like you're in the wrong place. I note that all this is possible. Hmm.
Ooh, I can do that. Okay, good to know. So from a rolly log, I can roll another log at foot level. Oh, that's useful. Okay. Uh, it's not sufficient for solving the whole puzzle. But then I can use this to poke. Here we go. I'm going to poke. Poke. <laughs> and then just get rid of you. There we go. All right. That kind of worked itself out after I poked at it enough. Very angry clock. Most human clocks seem fairly docile. However, this subspecies has a nasty temper. The clock here expresses outrage by hammering its bell-shaped horns repeatedly until it is soothed using a padding motion. <laughs> it is the most furious around 7 a.m. <laughs> What's this tree for? No, for, for real, what's this tree for? The only way I can possibly chop it is like this. And the only way it can possibly... Oh, wait, it's for this. There we go, I got back. <laughs> that's what the tree's for. Okay, I figured it out. Uh, all right, well, that's uh, the end of this road, it would seem. Unless there's stuff hidden in the clouds here, which I don't have any reason to believe there is right now. All right. Well, cool. Um, I do have a footprint icon there. I don't recall. Oh, yeah, I do. Right. The water mixing spoon or whatever. Big spoon. Okay. So I stepped here and looked at the ex uh, exhibit and just went away. Well, you're in an awkward spot there, aren't you? Hmm. Oh, okay. That's why it's there. Got it. Cool. Um, so going this way. All right. Same trick, different length. Oh, not same trick. No, no, no. How did that last one work? How did that last one work? Okay, that tree was the one that made the bridge. Then I used it to roll the other one north. Okay, sure. So this one made the bridge, and then I made that move. Uh, is that useful here? Yes. Okay. Yeah, another thing I'm learning about this game is that it really likes to repeat itself in the same group of islands. So, like, if I see a trick that's distinctive once, it seems productive to try and reapply that trick in other places. Dinner surpriser. If a dinner experiment went awry, humans could use these silver pods to conceal the charred mess until the last minute. This was useful at dinner parties, as the guest would be seated by the time the disaster was uncovered, and would thus find it harder to flee. Uh, well, that would get that there and get me stuck. I can also do this. What it feels like I really want to do, though, is this. Hey, look. Reapplying, same trick, once again. Oh, but I can't. Right, okay, so maybe demonstrating that that doesn't work that way. Meaning what exactly? So I can do this and still have a bad time of it. Yeah, because that just gets me stuck. So obviously I need the too long to go north. 
That's the only way anything gets done here. Seems really unlikely that can ever be anything. So it's gonna be this. Okay, well that lets me access the other side if I uh, do it this way. Maybe that's useful after having done this. Nope. <laughs> sure isn't. Maybe this is useful. Yeah, sure is. Okay, thanks Stump. That's all I needed. I feel like I'm just not seeing the most basic stuff, but like, possibility space is surprisingly large in some of these puzzles. And all of these just involve spotting like the one thing that is going to get to the exits with a lot of very similar looking things that ultimately don't. But it's not the most obvious thing that they don't at the time that they're done. Uh, I feel like I'm going to set this back up so I have a... Hmm. I don't want to do that. That gets that stuck. What am I... I'm just chopping trees without knowing what I'm doing. Um, before I mess with that, let's do this. So I think this is... Oh. Well, I thought it was going to be the trick where I, uh... Yeah, like this was going to be the trick where I roll that over there, then use this to push it that way, but then this rock was here. <laughs> uh... I mean, my pound sign analysis here. That just doesn't go much of anywhere at all. So, like, I need to get this reoriented so it can be a bridge there somehow. And I really don't see how this tree is ever going to help with that. It gives me a way to push left from there. Allowing me to set this back up. Does it, though? No, it doesn't. No, because I can only do roll moves. Yeah, so that could never be useful. Okay. That can never be useful as far as I can tell. This gets there in the wrong orientation. This gets there and can't turn into the what I need. Like, I say these have a surprisingly large possibility space sometimes, but this one looks pretty small. Yeah, nothing to do with it from there. Nothing to do with it from there. Something to do from there, which is to put in the water in where I want, but not how I want. Put in the water not where I want or how I want. And from here... Yeah, I can get it there. Oh, hey. So wait, what does this mean? Well, it means a raft there, which doesn't really help me at all, because there isn't a, uh, a push-off point. And even if there was, like if that tree were still intact, it would just take me here. So that's not what I'm after, but maybe I'm getting closer. Like, that's the most Im interesting thing on the pound sign emanating from that tree, which does then allow... Okay, so there's another input I can do, which is that, which is pretty useless. 
Like, there's nothing special about this state as far as I can tell. So if I want one from there, it's going to be this. Okay, and then that. Okay. But then there's nothing that I care about here. Wait. Yes, there is. Oh, you sneaky. <laughs> I don't build a bridge on this island. I build it on another one. <laughs> oh, that was nice. Uh, rafting from here. Got it. I never play this out in my head before I do it for real. I think I played it out in my head and it worked... Except, yeah, it did. Sure, I just go across there. Yep. Alright, sure, why not? Two-way traversable. I wish that I didn't have to ride the raft to know whether I could get back after riding it or not. Like, it makes me reluctant to ride any raft ever because it might cause me to lose access to where I just was for a time until I find a monster post. Uh, so I can do this. I can knock that off and make that happen. Cake in the rock doesn't affect the log on the other side. That doesn't do anything. Whoops, I, okay, I thought I was on land. Well, that gets me here, not where I was expecting to go, but you know what? It's another island. That works for me. Uh, okay, so this is trivial. Making me wonder if there's another way to do things. It looks like there is, kind of. Mm, no, not really. No, that's the only way that leads anywhere visible. It's a monster post. Cool. Uh, that's gotten to by that island, probably. Let's go try that again. It feels like I should be able to do it. So to do anything here, I... Well, uh, there's another option. Then bridging there. I can bridge here. I don't know if that's any better in any way. Like, once I'm here, though, what do I do? This... That's impossible. All right, this all feels right. Not anymore. And also, like, what am I even doing? I guess building a raft there, okay. Uh, so the problem with that right now, ah, so it would be ideal if I didn't already have a log there, but was primed to place one. But I have to already have had a log there if I want to do this process. Okay, so is there some other way I can manipulate this tree? Yeah, I can roll it back into its own stump. And then everything works. Okay, cool. Let's do a little shuffle to reorient. Do not press button. The first time our monster experts pressed this button, they heard a loud crunching noise followed by a scream. We assumed that was a coincidence because we pressed it again more than 50 times and there was no further crunching or screaming. <laughs> okay. All right, I'm here. Neat. Uh, let's get an overview. All right, overview shows me bothersome stuff down there that I feel like I should address before moving on. Oops. Uh. What did I expect to happen? Somehow I thought that would roll all the way over and hit this. Um, you can't do much. Well, I can do this.
Hmm. Okay, I do see that, that if I roll this here, that will allow me to push this this way. What I don't see is how that's helpful. Because I think it's really not. Oh, uh, well, now, wait a second. What am I... Right, yeah, there's a there's a one wide uh, gap there. Sure, of course it is. Why would that not be helpful? I can do that. Uh, okay, so now I'm over here, and this leads to rafting from there, maybe? That's what it feels like to me. One of these trees is probably getting sacrificed in the process. This looks trivial to do as a raft, and it is, okay? And then that's a shortcut. Neat. Well, that's nice. I think I left myself some footprints back up there, though. Uh, this spot I'm going through was my previous understanding of the south edge of the world. No, it wasn't. Uh... But I do believe this is farther south than I've ever been. Oh look, it was a one-way raft. <laughs> Guess I'm stuck here now. Uh... Uh... Okay, so there's an island over there. <laughs> I just noticed. Yeah, I'm here now. Uh, hey, what's this do? It's gonna roll it that way. Mm -hmm. So that'll put you in the water there, if I want that for some reason. I don't know why I would. So something horizontal over there. That doesn't look possible to me. So maybe something horizontal here. That looks slightly more possible. Does it? No, not really. Or am I rafting? If I were... From what position? Well, I'm kind of stuck here until I answer some of those questions. Oh, what? Huh. Instead of collapsing down there and making a raft, that continues. Unexpected, but I guess it makes sense. Sure. Never done that specific interaction before. What about this one? Now you're trapped. You don't get a choice. It forces it to the south. Whoa, okay. Weird stuff here. Huh. Yeah, so they just refuse to coexist, so that actually pushes it out of the way. It's not helping me. Okay, see so now this is a way to start getting this over here, but why? I don't need it over he here. Even if I could push it north, that's just the same orientation as if I chopped it down here and I can't push it west any easier than that. It bothers me a little bit just how almost complete the cloud cover is here. Like, at this moment, I cannot tell there's an island over here. There's a tiny, tiny bit of yellow if I know where to look. Like, now I can see it. But a lot of the time, I just can't. So, yeah. Like, right. So, from here, the clouds pull back a little bit. And I can see that, yeah, bridge here would be fine. Bridge here would be fine. So, bridge here would require something horizontal to be up there. Getting something horizontal up here involves rolling. Rolling seems like it cannot ever stop against this north surface because there's no way to put an obstacle there. 
However, putting one here seems just as problematic because of where the stump is. So what about... Okay, see, so I have the same problem in the south. If I wanted to make a horizontal raft here and go south with it, which would be possible if I could do it, I would still need a, a backstop for the horizontal rolling. Unless I make a raft on land, can I do that? Yeah, this might be the point at which I need to make a land raft. So same orientation. I don't know if I want north or uh, north south or east west. Either way would get me over there potentially. And uh, neither way would get me over there because even with all that, the geometry doesn't allow pushing that way. So, like, if I could move you gently over that way a little bit. Yeah, so to make a land raft, I would need a log essentially already in the position where it would be if I were chopping that tree down and I moved its own uh, self there. So that would mean... Okay, yeah, let's just evaluate all the orientations. So, vertical here. Not quite doable, but close-ish to the realm of possibility because of this rock, because I can do this and this. I just can't push north. If I could push that north twice, then I'd push it over there and chop this, and I'd have a land raft there that I couldn't do anything much with, though. Like, I'd push it there, I'd push it... N no. Yeah, no, okay. So, even if I could make it there, it wouldn't help me. Okay, so horizontal here. Uh, that's... No, no, not really close to being possible. Okay, vertical here. Here. So you'd have to be the second one that I would chop. That one, once again, is close to being possible. I just can't stop you rolling after I do that. Like, I want you to just slide once instead of rolling. Which isn't going to happen. All right, horizontal here. Can't really get you out of there horizontally. Vertical here. Okay, so vertical for you means this. Can't get it off of that. Stuck. Uh, horizontal here. No way. Horizontal here. Not useful. Vertical here. No way. All right, well, I've enumerated my possibilities and decided none of them are correct, so maybe I'm not making a land raft. Or maybe there's something I need to do with the, like, forced push behavior. Like this whole thing on land to get one into an otherwise impossible position. That's... Still would mean chopping one tree onto the other. What? What? What a nasty little spot. Whoa, what happened to that tree right there? Oh, just a bunch of leaves flew off it. I see. Okay, is that one useful? Not yet, but maybe it could be eventually. That's starting to look like something.
That doesn't seem right. Hmm. No. That's the closest to looking like something useful that I've had so far. But how can I turn it into something that's actually useful? Alright, let's think once again about preconditions. So horizontal thingy here. There's no way that's ever going to happen unless I have something vertical here and this tree till it's still intact. So that would mean... Well, yeah, that's pretty close to something I can set up. But no, you'd have to go back one and up one and there's no way that's happening. Something horizontal here. Once again, the backstop problem. There's no way you can have a backstop. Huh? Slide. Nothing does anything from here. Can't get this any further along that. Uh. I just really am not seeing anything that I can try that I haven't tried. Well, there's this. That's new. <laughs> Doesn't do anything. There's this. It's no better. There's using you as a stop for this, which helps nothing. What? Okay, well that was fun. <laughs> I took like 10 seconds to sit back and just think quietly to myself and I saw a completely different end state that was none of the things that I tried and looks super obvious in hindsight and yet I just could not see it. There we go. It's just that. Okay. <laughs> the rule still holds. If it's hard, you're trying the wrong thing. There's a crack in there. That's fun. Why do I have footprints here? Oh. Well, that's a good reason. Sure. Okay, well, so I accidentally left on this raft. It wasn't really accidental. But, like, I left on that raft and didn't really want to start a whole new adventure here, so I'm going to leave those footprints down there and come back to these, I think. Because, yeah, that's just an island I haven't even stepped onto here that leads to more stuff here. All right, so I'll try and finish out whatever's here and then go to that new zone. How did I get stuck for that? Well, just because there were so many possible end states and I was looking at all the ones that were not the right one. It happens. That's a monster's expedition. <laughs> See you next time for this.